After months of waiting, Finnegan is finally mayor, and at the perfect time. Last week, we got the gear to start the secret farming technique called pest farming, and it was just alright. But Finnegan has a perk which halves the cooldown of pests, and let me tell you, that makes this money method go from average to better than mining. Today, we're gonna give it our all to make an absurd amount of money, and also, we get a couple pretty rare things this video, and a special upgrade, so be sure to stick to the end to find out what those are. Also, of course, some of this was streamed live over on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash toadstarzero. Go drop me a follow with the link in the description or pinned comment somewhere around there, and uh, enjoy the video. Starting off in the lobby today, because I have some Inferno minions to check. Uh, they actually have a little bit over a day of fuel in them, so, uh... We luckily will get to see what about a day and a half has gotten us. So let's see. Can we pull the... Nope. Okay. Well, we got Vertex. That's fine. I forgot the items called. I, I just woke up. Uh, the Apex. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, the Inferno Apex. So uh, let's see here. What do you have? You have a Vertex as well? Nothing in there. Okay, okay. You only got 12 hours left on that. All right. We'll take that. So yeah, no Apex yet, but I'm going to leave these guys to go into all of Derpy, so we'll check in on them periodically. Okay, well, let's make two more fuels. Go over here and put some more ones in. Let's see, is there anything in this one? No, nothing at all. Well, you can have a fuel and you over here and you spawn a blaze, of course. Do you have any? Oh, you have two. Okay, our tier six has been going ham, apparently. Well. We'll do that, there we go, and uh, yeah, I guess we'll keep waiting. Doing my Crimson Isles dailies for rep right now, and dude, we have to get the entire lobby out here to take out Ashfang because of Derby. It's so bad, like, I'm even playing, yeah, I got second place and I was playing, uh, May, or Melee, yeah, which I usually don't do for it, but someone had to because we actually had to take out all of the blazes, so. Yeah, all that for 20 rep. My gosh, that took probably 15 minutes. It was not fun. <laughs> oh well. Let's go gambling! We got a Vanguard and my one skeleton key. Alright, shoutouts to QT Mar for the warp. Let's see, that's not quite what we want. Four Glacite amalgamations. Wow. Okay, we'll take it, we'll take it. Mithril plate as well? Okay, I would consider this more than a full refund. Dang, let's go. It's me, fire sale guy. Wait, don't skip this segment. It's a die fire sale. And look at this, dude. This is the coolest die they've ever put in Skyblock. And I've already prepped the gems to get 20 of these things. Well, technically 19, because i that's just how it works. But yeah, if you guys want to pick up this brand new fire sale that starts pretty much, I think, a day after this video goes up, or maybe as this video goes up, be sure to use code TOAD on the Hypixel store when you scoop up those gems. Make sure to get your gems in advance so you don't forget. I've missed two fire sales because I tried to buy the gems as the fire sale was happening, so make sure you get your gems early if you are looking forward to this, and uh, code TOAD to save 5% off and support my channel a ton would really mean the absolute world to me. But yeah, I, I have 25 alarms set for this one. I am excited. <laughs> All right, let me, uh, let's go back to farming or whatever I'm doing today. All righty, time to refuel our minions. There we go. Please place in my inventory. All right, let's see what these guys have now. Can I please go in here? Thank you. And one vertex. Okay, let's go ahead and give you a fuel. And oh, come on. There we go. What about you? Can I have a apex, please? Let's see. No, that's a vertex. Yo, Chili Pepper 6, that's actually huge though. I will throw that in and you are our tier 6, so you can have the last eyedrop I have, yep. Take that, and this is actually the last day of Derpy. I successfully did nothing this week. Uh, but in good news, in 18 hours, we're gonna get Finnegan, and I am so excited because if you didn't see last episode, there's a good way to make money involving Finnegan, and we will be likely making over 30 million coins an hour for five days, so yeah. I'm going to do nothing but pest farm for five days and maybe repair this bill bank, you know? I'm pretty excited for it. So I guess I'm gonna try and stall one more day by doing glacite comms. Uh, I'm trying to get to 20 mil glacite powder. We're at like, what, 14.5 mil right now? So another 5.5 more to go. And of course, still leveling all of our pets right now. I'm going through the turtle pet. So uh, we'll do that. Oh, was there something I wanted to do with fan? I forgot, did I already claim my spider? I think I already did, yeah. So we're leveling up the snowman now. He's just uh, chilling in there. He's gonna be going for a while, but yeah. 
I guess I'll be back to Glacite comms and hopefully I can stall one more day. And I did a grand total of zero Glacite comms that day. Okay, Derpy's no longer mayor, which means it's Finnegan time. So I get one more check on my good old Inferno minions here. I don't know if I'll keep fueling them. Uh, I guess we'll see. Ooh, two Vertex. Oh, I guess there's still another hour left on this fuel. Oh, well, there's probably not going to be anything from it. And that's fine. So let's see this one. Oh, we generated nothing. Dude, I swear the tier five does better than the tier six. I'm like convinced of it, but you know what? That's perfectly fine. I, I guess not really, but nine vertex. That's not terrible. I think I did what? Six fuel. So nine vertex from six fuel is actually kind of insane. Was it eight fuel or six? I don't, I don't actually know. It might've been eight. Uh, in terms of things I want to make with these, there isn't really a whole lot I can do. Uh, I need the ham radio, kind of. I don't really need it to max museum. It's just an item I can get. Uh, I could, of course, make an apex if I get 64 of them, but that seems kind of ridiculous. Uh, and then there's upgrading the inferno minions, which is, what, 1648? And then uh, the last one takes an apex. I didn't mean to close the menu, but I think that's everything. Oh, uh, yeah, 48 in an apex. And then... There's this, the alert flare, actually. Where's the alert flare? That is the only thing I could... No, I can't even make that because... Oh, I could make this, the Annihilation Cloak, which is another museum item, but is like the hardest one, so I don't really want to deal with that. Uh, alert flare 16 doesn't go in museum, and this is useless, so yeah. Don't really know what I'm going to do with these, but what I do know I want to do today is farm. Because the Finnegan perk, uh, the... Where is it? Pest Eradicator basically doubles how often you get pests. Uh, or even more than doubles, four times is the amount uh, in sprayed plot. So I guess it doubled because uh, it already 2x's it in sprayed plot. So that'll help with money a ton. And I'm really interested to see on how much money you'd get from uh, farming now. Uh, if you were in my last video, I was getting about... Joey, I don't think you're getting 130 pests per spray. <laughs> Anyways, I was getting about 20-ish million coins. Now I want to see if that goes up closer to 30. That would be pretty sick, so... Uh, I guess I'm gonna get my farming gear on and maybe we'll just do an hour test real quick here to see how things are. Uh, first thing I want to do here is actually go to Skymart and purchase three bustling reforge stones so we can actually uh, reforge our melon or mushroom armor. Uh, I would recom these, but I'm a little bit hesitant to because the recoms are gonna do almost nothing. And if they ever like ruin this way to make money, I don't want to be out for recombobulators. So I think instead we're just going to leave these like this. Yeah, because I probably wouldn't even, it would give me what, four farming fortune if I recomped all of these. I don't think that's going to be worth it. So we will put a uh, mossy on this one though, because uh, I don't know what else to do with mossy stones. So we'll do that. But for these, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, put them on bustling for that one farming fortune. And if I get more mossy, I'll put them on these, but... Uh, these stats should triple at night, so I'm thinking that'll be, what, 15 on this? Yeah. No? Maybe? I, I I don't know. Doesn't really matter, though. I'm gonna clear these pests out, and I guess we'll farm for one hour. Okay, first, I wanted to get some golden balls, because I actually ran out, and I was told that uh, Blessed, or our Bountiful, was actually better than Blessed for money. I thought that was only the case for um, Netherwart and Melon, but turns out I was wrong, so uh, yeah. I guess we need to swap Arcane Hope to uh, Bountiful instead to make the most money we can. Just checking my Infernos one last time. Looks like uh, we got nothing. Why are Bonzo staffs 10 mil? I don't even know. But nonetheless, we can go ahead and throw in here. And our results from Derpy was 8 fuel used, 9 Vertex obtained, which is awesome. Uh, and that's basically it. That's all that really matters. So we'll just deal with that. But let me go ahead and reforge the Cane Hope really, really quick. Um, is Please don't be more than 600k. Uh, yay. I was actually right. I remembered how much. Okay. So, now we are actually fully ready to go. Um, almost. Almost fully ready to go. I have to check one more thing over here. I need to grab a, uh, enrichment. Set all these to strength. There we go. Swap 47 enrichments to strength. Double check that all of this stuff over here is good and all of that. Yes, yes. Okay. We are ready to farm. So, I'm gonna clear out my pests. Uh, make sure we get our pest hunter bonus. The, uh, the thing that's over here. I'm gonna make sure to use this. Uh, we're gonna spray the plot, of course. And I guess I'll farm for exactly one hour. Uh, I'll clear out my socks and everything, make the test perfectly fair and all that, and let's just see how much we're able to get in one hour of cane farming with Finnegan as mayor. Okay, that's one hour. All my stuff just ran out. So, let's clean up the pests that we have here and see what we made. We only made about 200-ish K from Bountiful. I was figuring I was gonna make more, but... I guess it's because we were farming with the Daedalus Axe a lot because of the reduced pest cooldown. So, there we go. 
Um, I guess, uh, how many Tightly Tides did we end up dropping in two, or in one hour? We got three. Okay, that seems basically normal to me. Uh, let's go ahead and clean up our inventory a little bit here. We can sell all of these fermentos. We got four of them this time, not bad. And, of course, recipe, uh, wort. We're gonna sell the wort, and we're gonna sell the, uh, other stuff from this. So, recipe, uh, I guess just hay. Convert all of this into that. And there we go. Now let's grab the nether wart and the hay bales. There we go. Sell these. There we go. It's going to be most of our money. Our recipe cane. We got to sell our sugar cane as well. 55 sugar cane. Not bad. Not bad. Going to take that as well as all of the mushrooms. And that's basically everything we got from those. So let's see. The final total is I didn't actually grab the No, I did grab the cane. 24.9 mil. So right around the 25 mil range. That is lower than I expected. It is actually decently lower than I expected it to be. Interesting. I think I definitely need to do one more test after this. At least one more, maybe even a couple more because, you know, 25 mil, that's way less than I thought. I was thinking it was going to be closer to about 35. But uh, you know what? I guess maybe we didn't have the best of luck. I'm trying to see, like, did I forget to sell anything else? I mean, I don't think so. That's that's everything. Yeah, that that's that's everything, so... Meh, you know, just, just meh. Uh, I guess I'll try another hour though, see if we can make anything better. All right, bit of upgrades to do before we do our second test here, try and get closer to that 30 million an hour goal I would like. Let's upgrade two more of our pieces of Fermento to Pest 4. This doesn't really do too much, it just gives us like one farming fortune or something like that, so <laughs> it'll only increase our farming fortune by two, but nonetheless, we'll at least take that. And I want to buy a bunch of golden carrots from you. Let me just spam that menu. And I think it was you wanted that. 16 copper, that's not enough. How do I not have a... How is that not enough golden carrots? All right, surely that's enough golden carrots. There we go. We'll take that. And I need to serve like at least one more visitor. Please tell me one of you. Uh, yes, I can serve you. Okay, perfect. We'll take that. You don't need anything. You, I'm not doing that. You, I'm not doing that. Uh, please, please. I bugged him. Oh, no, he's gone. Never mind. Uh, but I do want to go to Skymart and purchase a green thumb book. Um, let's take one and put one on our pest vest. Because that should give us some fortune. Uh, looks like 4.1. Yeah, I guess that's worth the, the copper. That's more worth than doing a uh, cane milestone. So we'll do that. I don't think anything's worth recalling. So I guess I'll just do another hour test because I think we got pretty unlucky. This time I'm going to do it a little bit differently though. Um, I'm going to clean out my entire uh, agronomy sack here. And we're going to sell everything. I'm pretty sure that's only going to make like a 200k difference, but just to be as thorough as possible, we're going to sell literally everything we get from this, so I guess we'll see how the next hour goes. Okay, perfect. Time. All right, 59 minutes, 59 seconds for that pest. Okay. Let's see what the results of this hour-long test is. Um, we have five pests to grab. Let me make sure I do this correctly. Get the beetles first. There's one. One tightly tied hay bale is probably where we're going to end, unless I get lucky enough to pull a second one off of the final three flies. There's one. Let's grab you. Uh, there's two. And the last one right here. Come here. There we go. There's three. Okay, yeah. So one tightly tied. Let's go ahead and sell all of this stuff that we don't need right here. All of this can go. One fermento as well. Not great on the fermento half, but whatever. Uh, we got a decent amount of pest books. Uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. Actually, we got... No, we got seven. Yeah, we got seven. Okay, that's that's totally fine. Let's do that. We can put three of those away and then uh, use four of them on our leggings, I guess. Why not? One, two, three, and upgrade the leggings. That'll give us full pest four. Pretty nice. But okay, let's see how much money we're going to make from all of this stuff. So we need to sell everything, just everything that's in here. Every single thing we got from pests. Whoa, okay, maybe we don't grab the wheat quite yet. Let's grab, oh, I can do this. Uh, sugar cane moment. There we go. Let's grab all of this though. Make sure we grab everything except, oh, we have a lot of nether wart too. Uh, that's fine. We'll just sell this as well. Sell this all. Let's lock. Let's lock that so I can sell it faster. Anvil noise moment. That's fine. Sell, 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 sell. Okay. There's that. And then we sell all of this is zero. Some wart, some of this. Skip over the wheat for now. Make sure all of that's sold. And then we'll craft the wheat to hay bales. There we go. There we go. And then recipe hay. 
Tightly Tides. We can get 14 Tightly Tides. So let's do this, this, and double check. All of this has been sold. Looks like it. Uh, yep. Okay, so that's everything we've made. We can sell this, this, and this. We made, yeah, 26.1. That's pretty much exactly what I was guessing this was going to be after a second test. So I don't know. 24.9 and 26.1, that, that averages to 25.5. I, I don't think I can do much better than that. I mean, it comes down to tightly tied RNGs at that point, but I've done four of these hour-long tests now, and one to one and a half seems to be about right, so I don't know. I guess that's where my test is going to leave off. I mean, I, I don't think there's anything else I can sell. Nothing in my inventory. Uh, none of this matters because this was all mostly full or it is whatever it was. Um, yeah, and again, all of this was sold. Yep, every single thing and none of this I'm supposed to sell. These are just whatevers. Yeah, 26.1. I, I don't know, man. I just don't know. All right, I just did one more test for good measure and I didn't change my plot. Oh, well, that doesn't actually matter because I am done here. So let's take out the last of these pests, of course. Uh, I could keep going in the week contest, but I, I can't be bothered to be honest. So we'll just see. I had much better luck. Okay, I definitely had much better luck this, uh, this time around here. We got several tightly tied hay bales. I think four, I want to say, which is apparently what I'm supposed to get. Like, that's normal. So, I don't know. <laughs> but I guess, nonetheless, we got that. Um, and I think we got one or two fermentos, I'm not too sure. I think just one by the looks of our purse right now. But uh, yeah, we can see that we ended up with getting six, really? Six tightly tights? I guess so. I did definitely get a handful of them, so... You know, this is our definite best hour and a more than lucky one, so... Uh, I guess let's go ahead and just sell all of this stuff and see what we end up with in terms of money. I don't think this is going to be enough to break 30 mil, but, you know, I can, I can help, right? Uh, but this will probably be the best rates I'm going to be able to get all of Finnegan. So, whoops, I don't need to grab all of those. I just need to grab everything except that. There we go. Make sure we sell all of this. Perfect. One more batch and then we'll sell all of the wheat as well. Um, yeah, I don't know. 30 mil is probably too far out. Recipe, hey, let's turn all of this into tightly tides again. Yeah, only 13 tightly tides. I don't think that's enough. It's close though. Definitely closer than we've gotten in the past. Just gonna do one more scan here. Make sure we got all of this. Yeah, we did. Okay, and the grand total is... Oh, we did it. 30.3 mil in one hour. That is a outside of mining fiesta profile record for me, so... <laughs> that's actually that's quite a record that's like a record by well i guess four mil because we had 26.1 but i think my record previously to this was like 24 mil or something like that so yeah this is very good for money it takes a lot of effort takes a lot more work and uh is much more annoying on my wrist than mining is but you know 30 mile an hour this actually feels good it feels like it should be making this much uh, especially because we have a uh uh, a, what are they called? Mayor, uh, buffing the stuff as well. Uh, wake room? Nah, I don't care about that. I'm just cycling these visitors to try and get the, uh, the rhino as well for more dedication books, but yeah, there we go. 30.3 mil an hour. That's really, really, really good. Did someone say Vanguard break? Got my skeleton key here. Let's see. Come on. Shattered locket, I believe. No. Flawless Aquamarine. Eh, two ice cold books could be worse. We'll take that, I guess. I've been doing some more farming. We can actually upgrade our first piece to uh, Pesterminator 5, which is pretty exciting. Uh, but I've also been getting a lot of money. Also, the alpha server is closed now, which could mean the mining updates tomorrow. If the mining updates tomorrow, I don't really know what to do because looking at the length of the video, it's probably about 10 to 15 minutes long right now, so... I don't know, we might end up doing some mining stuff later, but I really, really want to keep getting my, uh, bank up. We're at a quarter of a billion, which is good, but, you know, still quite a ways off a billion. But yeah, I definitely don't think I'm gonna get a billion during Finnegan. I'll probably shoot for 300 mil, maybe 333 mil will be like a third of the way there, you know? Uh, and then we'll see, but I've heard some really, really good ways to make money mining, so... If the update drops tomorrow, I may just try some of those out, see if they're any better than pest farming, but I don't know, so far I've been kind of liking pest farming. It's a little bit more chill, but it's, I mean, it's about the same as I make mining rubies, so 
Uh, you know, it's not terrible. It's not OP though by any means. But yeah, I've been liking it so far. I guess I'm just gonna keep working on this and I don't know, I'll either come back with an update on how much money I have or if the mining update's coming out, then maybe I'll let you know. Hey chat, let's check what Zach's doing. What's he up to? Uh, he's farming. He is not pest farming. Interesting. Yeah, he's not pest farming. He's just regular farming. Fermento. Looks like he's farming carrots. Interesting. Alright, alright. <laughs> Why are you here? We're not spying on you. No, no, no. We're not spying on you. <laughs> Is this a coincidence? Alright, did you just join chat? I swear to God. You should be more worried about 30. You're right. Redeemed Hydrate, you got it. I joined when I first time. Oh my god. Yeah, then that was exact timing then, because I was like, hey chat, let's go see what Zach's doing. And I open up your PV. Awesome. Room temperature, shiny splash G fuel. That's the first thing I heard you say. That is hilarious then. Yeah, because I mentioned, or I heard you were like either doing dungeons today or farming. I'm like, I wonder if you're pest farming. That's wild. You mentioned, you asked a question. What was it? It was, are you max cane and wheat? No, not even close. I think I'm like Kane 32 and like Wheat 39, something like that. Uh, Kane 32, Wheat 39. Max is 46, right? It's like some weird number like that. So yeah. You can probably make close to 30 because I think you have better farming gear than me. Wheat 40, let's go. That's actually a huge milestone. W. All right, for the end of the stream, let's see how much money we're going to get. Let's grab all of this stuff, every last little thing that we have in here. Grab all of it. Is it gonna actually fit in my inventory for once? No way. It does. It actually fits in my inventory. All right, let's sell all this. We're thinking, come on, 25 mil. Can we get at least 25 mil? And no, no, we can't. This was a poor hour, actually. Double check our work. Yes, we sold everything. Into the bank it goes. 300 mil, just barely. All right. Well, we'll take that. It's time for the final upgrade. That's right, a full Pesterminator 5 Fermento set. This will make it so we have both a Pest 5 Mushroom set and Pest 5 Fermento set. So I actually don't need Pesterminator books ever again, or at least with the current state of Skyblock. So there we go. That's going to be two fully maxed Pest 5 sets. Absolutely awesome, but uh, it doesn't really do anything else. It was like one fortune extra, but you know what? It's good to have. Uh, bank is looking like about 318 mil right now. I want to try and get to like 333. So I'll probably do at least another hour of farming right now. Just kind of, uh, I was hoping the mining update would be, would be today, but it doesn't look like it's going to be today. So may end up having to wait a little while longer for that to happen. Either I logged off without checking my visitors or you can get spacemen while you're offline. Uh, I haven't opened him yet. But I guess we'll see what he wants. Enchanted baked potatoes. That's not even a terrible one. Uh, but I don't really want to get 13,000 enchanted baked potatoes. So, I actually want to leave him here though because it'd be funny to line up like both mythic visitors, spacemen, and two legendaries. I think that'd just be way too fun. So we're going to try and do that now, but unfortunately that means I need to get the, uh, the ravenous rhino still. So, I don't know, I guess Spaceman's gonna chill here, but I'm making it clear right now, I'm not doing the Spaceman. I'm not getting 13,000 enchanted baked potatoes. I just want to get a cool screenshot of all the cool visitors lined up. Also, this guy only gives 100 copper. Look at that. That's kind of, that's kind of goofy, not gonna lie, but... Oh well. You want to see something cool? Has anyone ever had a visitor lineup like this? This is currently as cool as a visitor lineup could get. I wish these two were swapped in places, but oh well. Uh, and before you ask, apparently you can't get the Ravenous Rhino right now. He might be bugged. No one that I've been able to ask has had the, oh, the Rhino pop up during the spin again. I think it's bugged. Apparently there might be another NPC that's bugged, but I'm not too sure. But either way, I don't think I can actually get the Rhino right now. So this is as cool as it can possibly get. Uh, I don't care about any of them. Uh, I mean, I guess I might do these maybe, but space man, I I'll keep you here for like a day or two, man, but <laughs> eventually he's gonna have to go to help, uh, to let me keep cycling visitors. But yeah, I don't know, I just wanted to throw this in because I, you know, this looks really cool. You don't see this very often. You know, now that I think about it, 
I never did the carnival, did I? Doesn't that end in like a few hours? Yeah, 11 hours? I have a lot of tickets to go through. That's a problem. I completely forgot. Because I have this. Don't I have like some from this guy and a bunch from these as well? Oh no. Um, hmm. What do I do? Yeah, look at all this. There's 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 50, 75 tickets right here. Um, okay. 75 plus over two snacks. I don't have time to do all of this. I, I'm not, I don't have time to play that much zombie shooter. So what I think I'm going to do is play the only minigame that's not time locked because having to play like 200 rounds of zombie shooter would take like eight hours and I, I don't, I literally don't have time for that. I ain't about to stay up all night doing zombie shooter. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get all of the tickets from the quests. Uh, so I'll do like each game like three times or something. And then we're just going to play the fruit digging game like 150 times or however many times I need to do because I can probably crank one of those out in 20 seconds compared to, you know, two minutes of zombie shooter or two minutes of the fishing one. So I guess we'll do that. It's definitely not ideal for tickets to tokens conversion, but I'm pretty sure I'll get more carnival tickets going through all of them on fruit digger than going through, you know, a third of them in zombie shooter. So let me do that and see what we end up with here. Well, I'm all out of carnival tickets. Uh, we got a lot. We got 3,289. So I guess we'll go to the event shop here and see what there is to buy. So mining fiestas or anything better I can get. Uh, I guess powder hoarder is not terrible to buy. It's only 400. So I guess we'll do that. Uh, I don't really care for getting titanium. So we'll probably save that one. A spooky festival. I do want to get the trick or treat. Mm, it's really expensive though. Maybe we will just keep going with what we did last time where we get the cheapest ones available to us. Uh, yeah, I think probably that's the play. Hey, Skyblock level up 429. Uh, that one's way too expensive. What do we got over here? These are all very expensive as well. We'll do this one, this one. Uh, maybe there's a cheaper one in here. This one's only 200, so we'll do that. Uh, this one's only 200 as well. This one's 250. That's really cheap. 389 tickets left. I can only buy, I think, Shark Sonar. I don't think there's a single other perk I can afford. Or Present Connoisseur. Which one do I want? Probably Shark Sonar. I think that one's going to be uh, definitely the most worthwhile. So there we go. I want to kind of try and get uh, a little bit more Carnival tickets, but I don't know how. I mean, I'm one off playing one more game, so maybe I'll be able to get one more upgrade before this thing goes away, but more than likely not. But I'm pretty satisfied with all the stuff we have upgraded now. Something I do want to buy just in case we do get coal is Dwarven Training 3 for 5,000 gold essence. That way we'll get as much mining wisdom as we possibly can. Now I only have two more perks to max out. All oh, this one's only one click away and then this one I need a lot of levels on. So yeah, I don't have enough gold essence to do those yet, but I just wanted to throw that in so you guys knew I got that. Well, this is probably the last hour of Finnegan farming I'm doing. Uh, I cut it a little bit early because I'm tired, so only 20 mil. But we have 410 million coins finally starting to get back close to that one bill bank. Assuming coal is next, which I really hope he is, uh, we will have mining fiestas, which may help us get back to 1 billion coins, but I guess we'll see what that's going to be tomorrow. I'm not happy. I'm, I'm very not happy. Like, come on. Really? Well, I guess that means I'm going to be doing nothing next week. Yay! I'm so excited to do nothing! Oh my gosh, why? I don't know, man. We've had Diana, like, every other week as minister with the darn event for the last, like, two months. But nope, we're having Diana again. Guess we're not getting a mining fiesta. On... It's not even on the bright side. It's just meh. But at least we get the sharing is carrying XP shares along with the uh, 60 public mining wisdom from Cole. So I, I guess we can level pets, but man, I didn't want to make another pet leveling video next week, but I don't know what else to do, guys. There, there's nothing else I can do. It, we have to level pets. So, I mean, you know, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I guess we can level 13 pets next week. That's like two a day. There's no way that's actually I show speed, right? Like, what is this? <laughs> I don't know who I don't know how someone got that name, but that's that's pretty neat, y'all. Anyways, um, so 
I guess we don't have mining fiestas next week, but it's not something I'm going to worry about now, so... Man, I guess maybe I'll get like a Chimera book right now today? I, I don't know, I still have some time left for this video, so... I am one Chimera book away from getting Chime 4 in my Daedalus Axe. I wasn't sure if I wanted Chime 4 Daedalus or Chime 3 uh, Claymore, but I think I'm just gonna go for the Chime 4 Daedalus, so... Maybe we'll just play Diana for a bit and see if we can get Chime 4. Ain't no way! <laughs> no shot, man. I'm done! A single Diana mob! Literally, I joined the party, I warped to the hub, they spawn an Inquisitor, I get loot shared Chimera on the first one. I'm done. I'm done. I'm literally done with Diana. Like, that's it. That's all I wanted. Literal- I- I- I killed zero mobs. <laughs> There's no way, dude. There's no way. Well, as promised, <laughs> they're so mad I did that, I don't blame them at all. Uh, let's go ahead and grab these Chimera books here. And this'll make Chime 2, this'll make Chime 2, this'll make Chime 3, that'll make Chime 4, yep. We're doing it for the memes now at this point. I could make a Chime 3, uh, Claymore, but I just don't really want to, so... Let's go ahead and just be extra careful with this. Make a Chime 3, and I'm definitely going to need XP to do this, right? Yeah. 157 levels, so let's grab out our, um, where is it? Our Grand XP bottles. Hopefully we can get to 157 with this. Yes, we can. There we go. And there we go. Let's do that. And look at that. Kaim for Daedalus Axe on Iron Man. That's gonna be insane. First, let's compare the magic find before and after. Right now we get 278, and this is going to be the most pathetic upgrade of all, but we're going from 278 to 285. That was an increase of, like, 7. Yeah, that was, that was definitely worth my four Chimera books. But oh well, it's fine. We get some pet luck with it too. Could help us for the G-Drag grind or the E-Drag grind, you know. Uh, so we'll absolutely take that. But man, I, I can't believe it. Zero mobs killed and we got ourselves the the Chimera. That's that's kind of sad. But anyways, that's good for this episode of Hypixel Skyblock Iron Man. We made a lot of money today and we got ourselves Chime 4 on the Daedalus Axe. So uh, that's going to be for today. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to leave a like down below. Hit the subscribe button and of course, use code TOAD on the Hypixel store. Scoop up a bunch of those new pastel dyes. They are going to look amazing. But uh, yeah, that's it for today. I got to get editing this and I'll see y'all in the next one. Take care.